Right, let's do delivery mission. Bring a group of two trunks with supplies to the lighthouse along the jagged shoreline. Uh, reach the destination with the A469 in the trunk. Hmm, a bit specific, because to get the objective you've got to do it in the dark. So I think it's obviously get it done quick. As soon as it's the first time I've done it, don't know what the hell I'm doing at this point. So, we just make do with whatever happens, I think. Right, bring... Da -da 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 -da. Crying out loud. Well, you've got to bring everything to there. It's like four different vehicles, I think. Attach the winch to another truck to make it follow you. You can attach the winch to a truck in front of you or behind you. In either case, the other truck can pull or push you to help you move over obstacles. Well, where's the other truck then? Okay, so we ain't there. Ain't... Let's get them winched. There we go. When connected to another truck, a winch can do two things. Pull, act as a regular winch. Drive, make the other truck accelerate and reverse to follow your truck. For now, let's switch to the winch mode to drive. Right, so on pull. Great, now press and hold F to make the other truck accelerate and push your truck from behind. What does it want me to do? We've done that, we figured that out. What are they yapping about? Alright, here we go. If your truck is reversing, press and hold F to make the other truck reverse too, pulling you along. Press S to switch to reverse gear. Oh, right, that's pretty handy. By keeping two trucks connected, they can help each other get past obstacles. Continue with the challenge. Oh, right, this could be fun. Right, let's get the end break off and let's move our butts. Right, how far have we got to go? It's not clear at all, is it? There we go. Bloody hell, we've got a journey. Although the map's a lot shorter than it actually looks, so I'm hoping to God I can get across this, but really? I mean, I'm hoping it wiggles there. Maybe we go across that? I can't see driving across this. Jesus. Alright, oh, let's see how we go. Let's get all wheels do this. Why ain't it doing all wheels? Pressing the wrong buttons, isn't it? That's why. Jesus. Let's go. Hope he ain't having trouble. That's just extra weight to pull. Don't hit that log, don't hit that log. This is uh, going to be hard work, this. I reckon I should have gone to the right hand side. Let's travel in the mud, holy shit. Or oh, maybe I should, maybe I should have gone in the other side. Look at the state of this! Crying out loud. Definitely some damage. Come on, mate, nudge me. Nudge me, baby. Uh oh, I've got the other one stuck. They are moving, huh? Not very fast. Put a diff lock on, get some better traction. in a minute. Right, let's go. Give it some oomph. Stay at that one. Too busy watching now. Bit, 
bonkers this. Oh man, <laughs> that rock. It's like we slide past it, ain't happening. Sticks calls Abbott, and I think it's just sticks, it's a bit, it's really ridiculous. Let's put a diff lock on, so we can get out of this. Very, very wet mud. Or sand, pretty much. You stay away from that rock. I think they're going to hit it. See if he can give me a nudge. I don't think he's got enough traction from the water. Just got to go past that rock. Oh, man. All the obstacles, there's too many rocks. So we go on the wet mud or the rocks. I think I could have made it around that corner bit there, but Let's see if we can get through this. I've got that truck pushing me if need be. It almost like some form of traction. This is where I don't want to be. Deep, mud, deep, deep, deep mud. I don't want to be on these rocks either. Trouble is up there is like it's shorter look and this is quite long and it looks pretty deep. Wait, right, let's have a think. I can't really go there because it's not allowing me. I think potentially, to be honest, I think going as close to this surely is the best way of doing it. To avoid sort of drowning the driver. Because the deeper you go there, obviously that's deep water. So let's try and stay shallow. There is such a thing. Holy shit! Come and help me! Christ almighty, that other one's going to suffer as well. Not sure if my idea was good or not. I don't know how bad it could have been. How on earth are we supposed to get out of that? Careful with the logs, but at the same time that's all rocks in it. Control this a bit. We'll try and go through there, but at the same time, don't get locked by that bloody log. A bit far, gone a bit far. That's it, that's it, line it, line it. Nice. Right, let's get into nudge. this diff lock off, I might be able to go quicker now without that. Oh, that seems to be going better with it, doesn't it? Let's keep it on for now, it seems to, it doesn't seem to be getting stuck with that. Yeah, 
bit of fun, eh? Bit of fun. Not really watching how that one's driving. I'm hoping I don't have to guide that one around the rocks. Be careful, I'm going to go too tight. Swing it up, yeah, if I can. And then try and turn it. And then a real big turn. That's what I want. It's got that nice bit there. There you go. That's it, that's it, that's what we wanted. Get some good traction on that. And that one ain't been very smart about it, is it? Look at the state of that. Bloody loony. Oh, right. I'm able to drag that. Oh, I'm getting impatient. Getting impatient. Taking the diff lock off and then I'm having to put it back on straight away. Wait a minute. Am I missing something? Why is it saying my destination's the other direction? That ain't making much sense. I'm travelling this way and it's saying my destination's over here. On the old compass. Ah, <sighs> nor the compass there. Maybe I forgot something, I don't know. Right. How deep is this one? There's rocks right there actually, look, you can see it. Bloody going like a snail pace at the minute, barely getting anywhere. Here we go. This truck is definitely not designed for the water. Look at the state of it. As soon as you... One damage, water damage to the truck, four damage. Shit, we need to get out of this. It needs to push me now. Just flooding the engine. Oh crap, he's suffering as well. Come on, matey, you're gonna have to push me. It's hard to turn and go forward at the same time. the load wobbling about in there with liquid
no good bit to go across there, you've got the box there, you've got no choice actually but to go down the middle bit. Something I really didn't want to be doing. Make sure we keep turning so we don't sink. Annoying that the uh, mirrors don't work because you can't see the back end of his truck. Here we go. Repair it. Do you realize they're saying there? 